And do you want me to look at so, it right there? Yeah. So, uh, what issues are you going to pursue uh, once you're in Congress, uh, Senator? Well, um, I am going to continue my hope, uh, getting through the election and being victorious in November. My hope is to continue working on job creation and economic development issues, as well as good government, such as transparency and accountability, as well as um, issues dealing with child protection and safety. Also, uh, you've been a big uh, supporter of organized labor as well, is that right? That's right. I have, um, you know, I, my dad was a teamster. He worked at a factory in Rothschild, and we've always been uh, involved with the union. And I'm very happy to have the support of unions all across the state. And I don't know of anybody who's got better roots in the district than you do as far as uh, your education and your background. Could you tell my readers uh, a little bit about your background? Sure. Um, I grew up on my parents' dairy farm in northern Portage County. It was a small family farm. My dad, as I said, worked out um, at, and he did shift work at Foremost Farms. And um, he, during the winter time, he was laid off. And so there were, I can uh, really relate to the families that are really out there struggling now with uh, job loss uh, and are really um, concerned about their future. And so that has really shaped the way that you know, my work in, in the State Senate on economic development and job creation issues. So I went, um, having grown up on the farm, I went to UW Stevens Point, graduated in political science and public administration. My daughter's planning to go there next year. Wonderful. It is a great college. She'll love her experience in Stevens Point. And a great environmental tradition. I know you have a good record in uh, the Senate as well on those issues. Right, with the League of Conservation Voters and others. Well, we really appreciate your taking the time to for this exclusive interview with uh, Faithful Progressive. Thank you so much. Oh, well, thank you for the opportunity.